So we're a team sees and assist, and we're a team of three bioengineers and two electrical engineers. And we've been tasked by our company sponsor, Cyberonics, to create a seizure monitoring device for epileptics. The way that monitoring is done currently is typically done as an inpatient study, where they take video of the patient and they also connect a network of electrodes to the patient's scalp. So it doesn't apply or it doesn't translate to patients in their homes or in their places of business or just uh, the family's lifestyle if parents are wanting to monitor their children if they have a seizure. We have created the smart belt. So this is the device itself. Um, it is a belt that you wrap around the chest and so Andrew will demonstrate. Simply wrap it around, you connect these two snaps right here. And that completes the electrical connection inside of the belt. Then Andrew will simply place these, place the electronic module onto the belt we're measuring two physiological signs that relate to epileptic seizure activity. First is respiration rate. So we, we use this piezo-resistive fabric, which stretches uh, along with respiration. And then the second physiological sign we measure is electrodermal activity. These two electrodes are placed against the side of the body on the, si on the skin, and it detects skin conductance. So during a seizure, typically a patient can experience respiratory failure, sleep apnea, they, can also, they also have a very high electrodermal uh, response. All the data is sent via Bluetooth to an external computer or smartphone so the parent can have an alert later on um, to see if the patient is actually having a seizure and come and assist the patient. There's over 2.3 million people in the U.S. who have epilepsy and there's currently no real reliable outpatient device for seizure monitoring. So. Our hope is that uh, with the development of our device, we can make this cheaper, more affordable, more accessible to, to people who would normally not have this sort of technology in the outpatient setting, and hopefully help those people uh, live more comfortable, better lives, knowing that they have a device there that will uh, alert their caregivers in, in the event of a seizure.